Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to have you all here today. If you're new here, I'm your name. And let's be real, adulting is weird. It's like one moment you're in school and the next you're expected to know how to handle everything. Like nobody really tells you how to do it. You know, there's no manual or guidebook that comes with adulthood. So today I wanted to get real and share some things I wish I knew when I was 20. These are the lessons that could have saved me a lot of stress and confusion. Okay, picture this. You're 20, figuring things out, maybe eating ramen noodles for dinner three nights a week. No judgment, been that. It's a phase we all go through. There's so much pressure to have it all figured out, but honestly, that's impossible. And that's okay. It's perfectly normal to feel overwhelmed, so whether you're in your early 20s, late 20s, or just curious about the life lessons nobody really prepares you for, stick around. We're all in this together, learning and growing. These are the things I wish someone had told me back then, and hopefully they'll resonate with you too. Let's jump right in, grab a snack, get comfortable, and let's dive into the things that can make this journey a bit easier. Number one, financial literacy is crucial. It's the foundation of making smart money decisions. Seriously, I can't stress this enough. Understanding the basics of finance can change your life. When I was 20, I was all about that treat yourself life. I thought splurging on the latest gadgets and dining out was the way to live. Budgeting, investing, who has time for that? I used to think financial planning was for later in life. But let me tell you, understanding how money works is like having a superpower. It gives you the ability to make informed decisions and seize opportunities. It's not just about being rich, it's about having control over your life and your choices. Financial literacy empowers you to live the life you want. Learn about saving, even if it's just a little bit each month. Small savings can add up over time and provide a safety net for unexpected expenses. Figure out how investing works. It's not as scary as it sounds. Start with the basics and gradually build your knowledge. And for the love of all things holy, create a budget. A budget helps you track your spending and ensures you're living within your means. Trust me, your future self will be obsessed with you. You'll thank yourself for the financial stability and freedom you've created. Plus, compound interest is like this magical thing that makes your money grow over time. It's wild. The earlier you start, the more you benefit from it. So start now and watch your money work for you. Number two, health is wealth. It's a saying we've all heard, but how often do we really take it to heart? Your body is your best friend and it deserves to be treated with love and respect. And no, I'm not just talking about fitting into those jeans you've had since high school, although that's a bonus. It's about feeling good in your own skin, having the energy to do the things you love, and living a life full of vitality. Taking care of your physical and mental health should be your number one priority. This means finding balance in your life, whether it's through exercise, meditation, or simply taking a few moments each day to breathe and reflect. Seriously, put yourself at the top of your to-do list. Make self-care non-negotiable. Schedule it in like you would any other important appointment. Eat some vegetables every now and then. Your body needs the right fuel to function at its best. Incorporate a variety of colorful fruits and vegetables into your diet to nourish your body from the inside out. Find a way to move your body that you actually enjoy, even if it's just dancing around your room like nobody's watching. Because let's be real, nobody is. Exercise doesn't have to be a chore. It can be a fun and joyful part of your day. And don't forget about your mental health. It's just as important as your physical health. Take time to relax, unwind, and do things that make you happy. Talk to someone if you need to. Practice self-care and set boundaries. It's okay to say no and to prioritize your own well-being. Your mind and body will thank you. When you take care of yourself, you can show up as the best version of you, ready to take on whatever life throws your way. Number three, failure is part of success. Okay, I know this sounds super cliche, but hear me out. I used to be terrified of failing, like full-on panic attack at the thought of not succeeding. But the truth is failure is just a redirection. It's not the opposite of success. It's a stepping stone. Think about it. Some of the most successful people in the world failed a bunch of times before they made it. 
So embrace your mistakes, learn from them and move on. Number four, networking matters. Okay, I know what you're thinking. Networking? That sounds terrifying and awkward. And yeah, it can be, but it's also incredibly valuable. Building a strong network can open so many doors for you, both professionally and personally. Go to industry events, even if you feel like you don't belong there. Connect with people on LinkedIn. It's not just for old people, I promise. And don't be afraid to reach out to people you admire. The worst thing they can say is no, and honestly, who cares? You're awesome. Number five. Time is your most valuable resource. Seriously, you can't buy more of it. You can't get it back once it's gone, so you might as well use it wisely. Prioritize the things and the people that matter most to you. Say no to things that drain your energy or don't align with your goals. And for the love of all things good, take some time for yourself. Relax, recharge, and enjoy the journey. Number six, embrace lifelong learning. The world is constantly changing, and if you're not learning and growing, you're falling behind. But don't worry, this doesn't have to mean going back to school, unless you want to, of course. There are so many ways to learn new things these days. Read books, listen to podcasts, take online courses, or just have conversations with people who know more than you do. Number seven, don't compare yourself to others. Okay, this one is hard, especially in the age of social media where everyone is constantly curating their perfect lives. But here's the thing, social media is a highlight reel. It's not real life. So stop comparing your behind the scenes to everyone else's highlight reel. Focus on your own journey, celebrate your own accomplishments, and remember that you are amazing just the way you are. Number eight, build strong relationships. Your relationships with your friends and family are so important. They're the people who will be there for you through thick and thin, so nurture those connections. Make time for the people you love, even if it's just a quick phone call or a coffee date. Listen to them, support them, and be there for them. Number nine, passion and hard work lead to fulfillment. If you're not passionate about what you're doing, it's going to show. So find something that you're truly passionate about and go after it with everything you've got. It's not always going to be easy, but trust me, the reward is worth the effort. Yeah. And finally, number 10. It's okay to change your mind. You're not stuck with the decisions you made when you were younger. If something's not working out, change it. If your interests have changed, explore something new. Life is all about growth and evolution, so don't be afraid to switch things up. And there you have it. 10 things I wish I knew at 20. I know it's a lot to process, but hopefully it's given you some things to think about. Remember, you're on your own timeline and there's no right or wrong way to do life. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends or your younger self if you have a time machine. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more chaotic good vibes. Let me know in the comments what advice you would give to your 20-year-old self. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.